Hi, this is Soft Cell Electrical, and I'm your host, John, with episode number 140. In this episode, we're going to show you how to attach a ground bushing to various items that need to be grounded or that you can ground to so that your panel is properly grounded. First, let's take a close look at what we're looking at and that's it. This attaches this portion to the part you're grounding to and this lets a piece of either number six or number four copper through it that will attach to your panel so your panel is properly grounded to ground. Let's start with the rebar. Now when you ground a panel to rebar there has to be 20 feet of this in the concrete and then you have to have a ground bushing attached to it you see you have an open loop side here okay so what you want to do tighten both of the lugs down to where there is moderate firmness and you never want to use this side to cinch it down because you'll break this right off so what you do tighten that to a level where it's very firm but by no means cinched down and then you use the closed side to really just cinch that thing on and make sure you have a really super tight bond because the conduit needs to be grounded at any rate take this slip it over okay so now you've just increased your dimension a great deal so that it'll fit all the way up to one inch conduit and you notice that when I swapped that over, I had to switch the sides on this screw, which only makes common sense. Now the third use for this is called the water bond. And if you have a house that has copper plumbing, the copper has to be directly grounded to the panel. Now generally, this would be your main intake valve for your house okay so you take bot that's easily accessible and that's where you place your bonding lug we've got our flange side tightened cinch down that side and basically that's how you water bond your house to ground at the panel bonding lug and like i said there can be no interruptions in the wire no j boxes no wire nuts no butt splices nothing it has to be a direct line from here all the way to the panel that pretty much wraps up this episode i'd like to thank you for watching and have a great day